NAP President Professor Muzaffar Ahmed passes away. This is the photo of Professor Muzaffar Ahmed. All photos may not represent the story. Watch to become bilingual as this video is especially made for English learners. Professor Muzaffar Ahmed, President of Bangladesh National Awami Party, Pro Moscow NAP, has died at a private hospital in Dhaka today. The 97-year-old politician breathed his last around 8 p.m. at Apollo Hospitals, NAP Joint General Secretary Ishmael Hussain told the Daily Star. He was admitted to the hospital some days ago. He suffered from old age-related complications for long, Ishmael said. Professor Muzaffar Ahmed was the last living advisor to the exiled Mujibnagar Government of Liberation War in 1971. He was in the forefront all people's welfare-oriented movements from the language movement in 1952 to the Liberation War. He was born on 14 April 1922 in Juabdar in Kumala district. He completed his graduation and post-graduation from the Department of Economics at Dhaka University with distinction. He served in the Economics Department of Dhaka University in from 1952 to 1954. Professor Muzaffar started his political career in 1937 when he was a student. In 1958, military dictator Ayub Khan issued arrest warrant against him. From hideout, he organized movements against the then-president Ayub Khan. He came in open politics after eight years of hideouts. Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina has expressed deep shock at the death of the senior politician. In 1967, he became the president of the then East Pakistan NAP. He played a leading role in the movement of 1969 for the downfall of dictator President Ayub for which he was imprisoned. During the War of Independence in 1971, he was a key figure of principal Bengali leadership to attain Bangladesh from the cruel clutches of Pakistan's army. He played an unforgettable role in organizing about 20,000 freedom fighters under his leadership to fight the Pakistani army in 1971 in order to gain Bangladesh. In 1979, he was elected the Member of Parliament. News from the Daily Star. Please subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.